the star and the wheel of fortune it's going to be a brand new beginning here in love with a high level soulmate there's somebody here there there's like a lawyer or an officer a prosecutor okay a public defender Or they could be in the military, but th this person is like washing you. They're stalking you. He wants to speak to you so, so badly. Okay, I feel like for a lot of you, it's new energy. But this person is going to come towards you regardless. They know when they come towards you, their family is going to put them under harsh, harsh judgment. Okay, this is giving like a Romeo Juliet story. All right, Gemini, how are you? Welcome back to the channel. Star Seeds Diet here. If you're new, make sure to subscribe and join the Soul Tribe. We have a read for you guys, okay? This is who's coming towards you. It is a general read. So take what resonates and leave what doesn't behind. Cross watchers, you are welcome. This message is also timeless. Personal reads are in the link tree link in the, in the description box below. And with all that out of the way, we're going to get started. <laughs> Thank you so much, angels, ancestors, spirit guides, universe, galactic beings, ancient ancestors, elders, guide us in this read. For my Geminis, what messages do you have for us? Truly grateful for your divine guidance and celestial light. Okay, Gemini, what's happening? What's going on here? Mm. Okay, we have the moon, cancer energy. I feel a weird feeling. I, I feel this tingling sensation. Anyhow, you have the moon there. That's cancer energy. Um, that is the chariot and the moon card. Over here we have Pisces, okay, the High Priestess and the Hangman. This this is like a very, this is a very secretive energy. Why why do you, <laughs> Gemini? You guys always get the the stalking people. Number four upside down, an Emperor in reverse, Mars retrograde, Neptune in transit, the Moon. What do we have at the bottom? Justice. There's somebody here, There, there's like a lawyer or an officer, a prosecutor, okay, a public defender. Or they could be in the military, but th this person is like washing you, they're stalking you. Okay, the, this person that is in some sort of legal or, or, or security position. They could be working for the federal government, the Department of Homeland Security, okay? Some of you, this person could be working in the IRS or something. What on earth is going on in your re <laughs> What on earth, Gemini? It's something here. They said use the Kipper, okay. They said use the Kipper. But that number four upside down, I almost feel like this person doesn't want anybody to know that they have these feelings towards you. What do we have here for Gemini? What do we have? Journey and message. Journey and message. What's going on, spirit? What's going on? Journey and message. Yeah, somebody wants to send you a message. Somebody wants to reach out to you. Somebody wants to speak to you so, so badly. Okay, I feel like for a lot of you, it's new energy. Okay, I feel like this is new energy. Yeah, it's a masculine energy, okay? Whoever they are, right, doesn't mean that it's a man, right? But, you know, whatever your situation. 
Whatever your situation loves, okay? Take what resonates, leave what doesn't. What do we have here? Courthouse. I'm telling you, it's some sort of lawyer, prosecutor, public defender, attorney, <laughs> judge. I'm telling you, literally interested in you. So what's, what's the message here, spirit, in regards to this person? I need to read the book because those of you that are not familiar with this deck, let me, let me read the book exactly. Card number 22, what it says, because I like I cannot make this up. Official person. This is a somewhat challenging card. We meet the official person in the marble foyer of the officer's club where he greets us with a fine bearing and a nosh saber. The many medals from his imperial campaign shine against his bright red coat. Literally, he's any person in uniform, such as a military man, police officer, or fireman. There we go. I literally was picking it up in the energy with that Justice card. And literally the Ace of Pentacles and the King of Swords is going to be there. The King of Swords can often be a lawyer or a judge. So there's somebody here. It could be a police officer in the military, uh, okay, in, you know, in the court, you know, the courtroom, like they could be a lawyer, attorney, et cetera, et cetera. Okay, they're really into you, but there's something here, like they're having to stalk you in secret. Yeah, oh, they are in a relationship. They're in a relationship or... I don't know why I heard same sex like this could be a same sex thing for some of you I heard forbidden fruit forbidden love is something here like this person and you it would be like forbidden so you guys are a different religion different skin color different ethnicity okay th th this individual has strict parents or something strict parents strict family that you know it's like their, their family would not approve of you of you two being together yep the lovers they would not approve of the two like this person knows that their family their immediate family would not approve of you give us one more card spirit wealthy wealthy man mature man this individual has money I just have one more card, and I pulled out more. Halfway. <sighs> yeah, this individual could be a lot older than you guys. Or it could be an age gap as well. That could be another thing. Uh, but pathway, they really want to walk this path towards you. So they're gonna they're gonna make their move. They're gonna they're gonna approach. Even though they know, they know, okay, this individual. This individual right here, excuse me, they know for a lot of you, their parents are not going to approve of you, okay? It, it's, it, it is what it is, you know? Like, some people, some people have a hard time, you know, finally putting the foot down with their parents, or they could be indebted to their parents in some way, I don't know. Yeah, sudden wealth in reverse like this they and this is going to land over here they know their parents would not approve or or their family whoever these people are and you know what they could have outdated views you know like their their views could be outdated yep look judication and family room i'm telling you it's this person's family but this person is going to come towards you regardless they know when they come towards you, their family is going to put them under harsh, harsh judgment, okay? This is giving, like, a Romeo-Juliet story. That's what it's giving. Yeah, Justice, the Wheel of Fortune. I'm telling you, you're about to be on top of the wheel with this person. This is a new energy. Look, they know where you live. They know where you live, so they've been stalking you, Gemini. They know where you live, they've been stalking you. They drive by your place after leaving the courthouse, leaving the police station. 
Higher fan after a long day of work. Yep, Ace of Swords, Page of Cups. I'm telling you, they're going to make an offer here. They're going to make an off offer. Some of you, it's going to be April uh, 21st or April 25th, but they're going to make an offer. They're going to, the Ace of Swords, they're going to speak that truth. The Page of Cups, the higher fan, they want a relationship with you, Gemini. Okay. They want a relationship with you. They want to take you out to eat. They know there's going to be drama. They know people are going to be mad, especially their family. But, you know, they don't care. Look, they're they're coming under fire. I, I can't make it up. They're going to come under fire because they want this relationship with you. They want the Two of Cups with you. I'm telling you, they want to bring balance and have a brand new beginning with you. Look at that. The world. Look how beautiful this is. The world. Temperance. Four of Wands. I'm telling you, some of y'all are going to marry this person. Some of y'all are going to marry this person, this person. They know they're, they're going to catch fire because of their family, their friends. Because it's something here. It's like you guys are completely different. And yeah, I'm going to get TikTok notification right when I said this. You guys are completely like it's, it's the opposite spectrum. And it's something here like this person's family. Th this person's family, they're, they're just not, they just don't want it, y'all. Like, they don't want you for their son, their daughter, okay, he, she, they, them, whoever this is that you're going to be interacting with soon. I'm telling you. Yeah, the Wheel of Fortune, but Spirit is saying fate can't be changed. Look, there's going to be a brand new beginning here with this soulmate. I'm trying to tell y'all, the Star and the Wheel of Fortune... The star and the wheel of fortune, it's going to be a brand new beginning here in love with a high level soulmate. Completely new energy, okay? This, this, you know, this person's reasons for stalking you, yeah, they might be a bit deranged, you know, but honestly, they want to make the move on you. They want a relationship with you. This is what they want with you, with temperance and the world, okay? They want to have this beautiful beautiful cycle with you okay and they want to bring balance and justice to your life they want to have a healthy loving connection okay and they know people are going to be mad but this person they don't care because they've been watching you they've been stalking you driving by your neighborhood okay yeah i'm hearing parked at the cul-de-sac something here about being parked at the cul-de-sac like they've been watching you all this time and they've had their eye on you and they feel like you are a catch. Okay, they feel like you are a catch. I'm, I cannot even make it up. It cannot be made up. Page of Swords with the Ten of Swords. The Ten of Wands, excuse me. And the Seven of Swords. Like after a long ass day of work, this individual exhausted is always going to drive by your place. Okay. And stalk you in secret. To make sure... That you're still alive. That you're okay. Okay. Like they just want to make sure you're safe. Look this king of pentacles. I'm telling you. This individual is going to take you out on a yogurt. Frozen yogurt date or ice cream date. Like that's what they're going to take you out. Because I'm, I'm tasting it. I'm tasting that vanilla ice cream. That vanilla yogurt. Frozen yogurt. And I'm telling you right now. That summer heat is really going to be kicking it. Okay, th this upcoming spring, summer, that summer heat is going to be rough. So this person is going to take you on a little ice cream slash frozen yogurt day. Okay, I taste the vanilla ice cream in my mouth. It's crazy. They're going to kiss you after. They're going to give you the kiss, Gemini. I'm telling you, look at this. The Six of Swords, they're going to pay for the date as well. Th this is a whole, uh, a whole emperor here. Or you're going to be in this emperor position because of this person. Y'all about to meet the one. And you know, you might think it's a little weird that they've been stalking you, but they want to make sure that you're safe, that you're still alive, okay? And they want to make sure that you don't have anybody else. So their reasons for stalking you are a bit deranged. I mean, stalking in general, right? I mean, we all stalk people in some way, shape, or form. But you see, that's the thing. Like, if you're looking on somebody's social media, then whatever. But to actually go about and, and follow somebody and know where they live and, and like stay parked at their cul-de-sac to watch them, okay, that, that's, 
you know, like, come on now, we, we gotta be honest with ourselves, but you know, while his, re you know, while his or her reasons for stalking you could be deranged, in essence, this individual means you no harm. Yep, Ten of Cups. I can't make it up. I cannot make up the energy I picked up on. The Ten of Cups. Y'all gonna have a victory with this stalker. They're no longer gonna be a stalker. They're gonna be your soulmate. Yep, they're dead. Look. They're possessive over you. That's why the Eight of Swords, they wanna know what you got going on. And the Devil. They're ready. They're ready to spend the night with you. Yes, they are. Gemini, they're ready. Okay. Eight of Swords, Empress, and an Emperor. They want to tie themselves down with you. So y'all about to be in a relationship, a lot of you. So that's where I'm going to leave it. Beautiful energy. This individual could be a Cancer, Pisces, Aries, Aquarius. Mm. So that's where I'm going to leave it. Or Capricorn. But that is your read. That's what I have for you. I hope you enjoyed this. I wish you the best of luck and I wish you love and light. Take care.